Hello and welcome to Town & Country TV. Today we're at the Alabama Auto Show and they just so happen to have a Shelby GT350 here. You've probably heard about the vehicle, but I want to give you a complete walk around and let you see what this thing's all about. Now you'll see as you look down the side, it's very aggressive. It has a stiffer, lower suspension than your Mustang GT. It's going to handle better and it's going to get traction better as well. This one is white with blue stripes and just looking good. You'll see uh, on the back side got a lot of Shelby emblems and you do have black Ford wheels right there with Brembo brakes all the way around. 305-35ZR19s on the tires and the front are a little bit smaller. They are some, let's see, they are some two, looks like 295-35ZR19s and then like I said Brembo uh, brakes right there for the stopping power all the way around. Now on the side it's got the GT350 badging and it also has some good looking side scoop. It goes along with the body lines really well with the vehicle and gives it a nice look. Now coming around the back side we got uh, the quad tip exhaust. Looks a lot like the Roush system and this thing sounds really good. Let's go ahead and check that exhaust out. As you can tell, the exhaust sounds incredible. It's all thanks to that new 5.2 liter V8 with the flat plane crank that I'll tell you more about that in a second. And you'll see right here it's got a lot of black gloss. You can also get the black gloss roof if you wanted to uh, invest in that option. And then you'll also have black gloss mirrors. So that's just uh, kind of like a what they're going for with this vehicle. Now this one is a prototype and unfortunately I did not arrive in time to get the keys to open it up, but I do have some B-roll I want to show you real quick. On the inside, the GT350 resembles a Mustang, but with a couple of unique add-ons. It has Recaro seats with GT350 embroidered in. It also has special badging all around with the vehicle numbered. This one does not feature the tech package, but with that option on the 2015 model, you'd get heated and cooled leather seats, magnetic ride control, my Ford Touch with the all-new SYNC 3 system, and more. So now let's check out this engine. Like I said before, it's a 5.2 liter V8, and Ford is telling us it's going to produce more than 500 horsepower and more than 400 pound-feet of torque. Those aren't the official numbers just yet, but it, they'll be released here shortly. And um, The significance in this engine is it's a flat plane crank, and what that means is um, it's going to be higher revving and it's going to sound louder as you can tell by the, uh, the exhaust clip earlier uh, it just gives it a whole different sound that you just can't get with a cross plane crank and that's the same technology that you see in a, a Ferrari I mean it's not really new technology uh, the cross plane crank is new technology but this is a, a higher revving option and it's going to make for a, a more horsepower producing engine without any supercharger or turbochargers. So we haven't really seen the front end yet and there it is you'll see a, a nice airflow through the grill. It's got like a honeycomb grill there so a lot of air can flow through there. You'll see the Shelby uh, Cobra emblem right there and then down below it's got a whole different front fascia you'll notice in the front chin splitter down there compared to your, uh, your Mustang GT same kind of headlights and stuff but all in all there is your vehicle is one heck of a ride looking sharp all the way around and i can't wait to get them into the dealership so we can test them out now we've actually already been allocated seven of these vehicles so we'll have at least seven of the 2016 model and the 2015 model has not been released yet but it's going to be only limited to 137 uh, vehicles total and only 37 of them are going to be the GT350R, the track ready vehicle. So be sure to subscribe for those videos later on down the road and if you like this video please thumbs up it really does help us out. Also comment if you have any questions we've got the answers. Thanks for watching and have a great day.